welcome to English for All with me, Kabiru Musa Jamaji. On the program today, we will be learning 10 more English expressions. Listen very well, please. Number 31. The car drew up near the school. The car drew up near the school. This means the car arrived and stopped near the school. The car arrived and stopped near the school. If I say the car drew up near the school, I mean the car arrived and stopped near the school. Number 32. You are a real gem. You are a real gem. This means you are a great person. If I say you are a real gem, I mean you are a great person. Number 33. He is recuperating from the illness. He is recuperating from the illness. This means he is recovering from the illness. He is recovering from the illness. If I say he is recuperating from the illness, I mean he is recovering from the illness. Number 34. The village was ravaged by the attackers. The village was ravaged by the attackers. This means the village was badly damaged by the attackers. The village was badly damaged by the attackers. If I say the village was ravaged by the attackers, I mean the village was badly damaged by the attackers. Maharan singi wa kawyang illa so say. Number 35. It is drizzling. It is drizzling. This means it is raining slightly. It is raining slightly. If I say it is drizzling, I mean it is raining slightly. Ana ye yefi. Number 36. Try to mollify him. Try to mollify him. This means try to pacify him. Try to pacify him. If I say try to mollify him, I mean try to pacify him. Kaiko kari kararasheshi. Number 37. This is a lame excuse. This is a lame excuse. It means this is a weak excuse. This is a weak excuse. If I say this is a lame excuse, I mean this is a weak excuse. One nang uzirine dabashi de karifi. Number 38. Will you tell me what is eating you? Will you tell me what is eating you? This means, will you tell me what is worrying you? If I say, will you tell me what is eating you? I mean, will you tell me what is worrying you? Number 39. The ball is in your coat. The ball is in your coat. This means you are the one to decide. You are the one to decide. If I say the ball is in your coat, I mean you are the one to decide. Kaine ki da nama. Number 40. I will wash my hands of this matter. I will wash my hands of this matter. This means I will stop involving in this matter. I will stop involving in this matter. If I say I will wash my hands of this matter, I mean I will stop involving in this matter. Before we go, a quick revision. Number 31. The car drew up near the school. This means the car arrived and stopped near the school. Number 32. 
you are a real gem. This means you are a great person. Number 33. He is recuperating from the illness. This means he is recovering from the illness. Number 34. The village was ravaged by the attackers. This means the village was badly damaged by the attackers. Number 35. It is drizzling. This means it is raining slightly. Anna yeyepi. Number 36. Try to mollify him. This means try to pacify him. Yiko kari Number 37. This is a lame excuse. It means this is a weak excuse. Wannan uziri ne da ba shi da karfi. Number 38. Will you tell me what is eating you? This means will you tell me what is worrying you? Number 39. The ball is in your coat. This means you are the one to decide. Kai ne ki dauka da nama. Number 40. I will wash my hands of this matter. This means I will stop involving in this matter. Zansami Hanuna da gawannan batun. Thank you for listening and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel namely Kabir Musa Jammaji. God bless.